That's not your boat. What does he have? Fred, what do you have? What do you have? What is that? You brought us some paper towel, buddy. How he moves from boat to boat is something I've never seen before. He acts as if he owns every single boat in the harbor. Get off that boat. What are you doing? Fred! Why don't you come on your own boat? He's like a born boat cat. As you seem to keep the gangway up like this, so his back's going to escape. But Fred escapes. Fred is the happiest cat ever. He's like a dog who just wants to go greet everyone. It's tiring because as soon as there's somebody out on the pier, it's like, oh, there goes Fred. He just assumed his position as a mascot of the harbor. Sometimes I have to pick him up and move him. No. No. But once I move him, he walks in the direction that I want him to. He's never really known anything other than boats. We were hanging out on the boat. We see this tiny little orange and white kitten. And my husband goes, just go pick him up. When I first started sailing, I had never been on a boat before. And I went on the boat and I was like, this is exactly where I need to be. And it seemed like the same thing with Fred. We sold the boat in Greece. We actually decided let's just move to the US. Fred is used to having a job. He's used to having things to do. Here he's living like every other cat. He's enjoying his retirement. He sits by the fire. He's taken up bird watching. He's gained a couple pounds, I think. You look pretty pleased with yourself. We went from living on a Greek island where the largest grocery store is, is the size of the living room. Here, everything is big. See, this is the parrot you've always wanted. Although he's really enjoying his retirement. What? We did get a new boat. We're going to be living on it, sailing around. The boat is actually dedicated to Fred. We had a logo created with his face on it. It's like a little pirate Fred. 